So we're in this uh, season of valedictories, and Rick and I properly being acknowledged for our stupendous accomplishments. You know, but I, I want to say this about Dwight Hall. You know, Dwight Hall was doing it when it wasn't as fashionable as when we began doing it. We're new to this. We've only been doing it for 20 years. You guys for a lot longer. In your acknowledgement of Columbus House, such an important organization, Shelley and Gordon, what you guys have done, have been, Gordon, we're all set for the festival in two months, right? Okay, Gordon's got that. Amalia and Emily and JB, one of our great partners in school reform, on behalf of Dr. Mayo and I, have been a great partner. And I just, I wanted to say this. I grew up here on the east shore of New Haven. Um, and I grew up never going on the campus of the university uh, until I was 18 years old. And I would take a bus on the corner of Temple and Chapel every day uh, to go to high school and would transfer to there. The university was not interested in me, and frankly, I wasn't interested in the university. We were communities separate and apart from one another. In any community, when it has people who are not connected to one another, who form their views of one another based on an ignorance or a prejudice or a fear that they learned in high school, cannot accomplish or do anything. What Dwight Paul has done all these years is build connections and relationships. Doing the grassroots work while the treetops weren't doing the work, while the treetops were not there. And in the process, you lay a foundation, Dwight Paul laid a foundation for the work of some of us late comers to this effort. Great job, though, we did do it, I said. So I want to just say this. What I hope students take from Yale is not only a degree, but a set of experiences and values that tell you something. That tell you the most important things you're going to remember in your life are these relationships that you've had with one another. That the service to others is really about service to self and making yourself whole and complete. And that it will serve you tremendously well in whatever you do after you leave New Haven. So as some of us leave our current roles from New Haven and stand here tonight with you, we stand among giants. And I admire and I stand in all of all of you. Thank you so much.